No, we're out checking. Nice tonight. 7.08 p.m. right now. 68 degrees here in southern Vermont. Yeah. Bubba over here. Bubba, you're getting all black. You're getting, look at, you're all white now. Huh. You rolling in the dirt. Are you? What are you doing? Huh? Oh, there's Coon. Coon. Hi, Coon. See your little bum foot? She was born without a joint. She was, I picked her up on the road when she was just a little kitten. She was like six weeks old. The mother abandoned her. Truck ran over her and, you know, she's a female and Bubba's a male. Bubba's about three years old and Cooney's going to be two in September. I picked her up in October. You know, there's Callie. She's the runner. She runs a household there. She's about eight, maybe almost nine now. She got her tail chewed off by a fox. You can see she's got no tail. We all love each other. Like playing with each other. Cody like likes to take over and huh. Yep. She was a wild cat. I rescued all three of them. She used to be a veterinarian over here, and I think a lady came from Troy one time, and the cat jumped out, and they were going to get her spayed. And it was wild here for like a couple years, roaming, until I finally got to get up to her, and then by that time, the tail was off, and she was licking it and nursing it herself, so, but she's good now. That's a little, uh information on how the cats. Yeah, just because it's a farm, they sometimes drop the cats off. That's where Bubba came. He was about six or eight weeks old and he showed up. We took him in too. Hey right, Bubba, he's a good boy. We got all the dust and dirt on him now, I'm rolling around. <laughs> Anyway, I was going to come out and show everything, but little Coney, she's just a little cutie, huh? She's just a little cutie. Well, they love having her fun, chasing each other. Little Coon girl, huh? I like that little tail, huh? You the little cutie? Yes, you are, huh? Yeah. Yep, that's how she was born. But you got a nice little fluff tail now. Look at that. A little color, little butt. She got a little heart, little heart vagina. You can see it's a heart. <laughs> it really showed up when she was younger. But you probably could have saw it. <clears throat> little black heart and bubba. Alright, let's go take a look. How beautiful everything is. Nice sky up there with the clouds. Now well, it's about 7 18 right now. The sun's out there in the silo. my favorite. That always makes an awesome picture. All those little barns back there. Little coon, huh? Little coon. <laughs> yeah, the cats love to come out when I'm out here. Yep. Just be an old silo here. 
you know, I'll go show everybody. I'll show everybody the silos, but there used to be one, two, four silos. The one, one right there, you can see some of the, where it used to be, the outline of the roundness and the cat fight going on. And then over here, cool out there. This is where the veterinarian used to be, where they drop a lot of animals off and they rescue a lot. But you can see where the silo here, and where the other two used to be right here, and where they used to run the grain into the barn before. There's a little platform there. You can see. Now it's all been closed up and the barn's inside. You can see. It's hard to see in there. Yeah. You might be able to see a little bit of it. But here's the other silo. Wall's falling over. The little coonies gotta come. See? All the cats they just have to follow me everywhere. Well, these are where the two silos were. Little Cooney, jump up there. Good. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Huh. Used to be a building here. See the old spikes. Yeah. Huh. What do you think, Coon? Huh? You can't go in there. No, we're not going in the barn. Well, let me see how cool that looks. in there. See, there's a window there. There's another window up there. You can climb all the way up into the side. Well, you can build the building right on the side of it. It's pretty cool. Well, there used to be the veterinarian office. Now, Cooney, what are you doing? My goodness. Little explorer, you wouldn't think that little bum foot you could get everywhere, but she does. You know, she does. Okay, got a long video. Well, it's up to eight minutes, so fun with the cats. Hope you enjoyed it all, folks. And the sunset. Oh, yeah, I'll show you the inside here how they made a little place. See that? In a little office. Go right inside. The side of the silo is pretty cool. Alright. It's gonna do it, folks. Yep, lost our sun already. We don't usually come over here. You can see the rest of the rest of the farm here. Goes all the way to the road. Coon, are you ready to go back? Huh? You ready to go back? Huh? Yeah. I know. I'm a good girl. I'm a good girl. Okay, let's go. Come on. I'm not going out to the road. Come on. Coon, are you coming? Bubba, go tell Cooney to come. Come on, I don't want you by the road. See, the car's coming. You need to stay up on the farm. I want nobody by the road. Come on, go back in the back. Yep, all right, Cal. Walking around. Okay, you coming? I know Kelly does, huh? She's a good girl. All right.
Okay, thanks for watching everyone. Kelly's gonna escort me then. Yep, black taco's ready for Sunday. I'm going to sucker pond to the beaver dam, so. Then we go. Alright, thanks for watching everyone.